Hey, my friends, Teresa Rose here, Nelson Firehouse Medium. How are you? Having a good day. A question was asked Can loved ones and spirits send us uh, people or pets as companions? Yes, they can. And uh, I'm going to share a real quick story um, about a pet. When uh, my, my Brandy and Ellie, they were both labs, uh, my, my Brandy had passed in 2012, and I had Ellie. And fantastic dog, by the way. Um, but every time I would go, like, snuggle with her or hug on her she's like she can get up and leave and i'm like oh. i said you know what my next dog is going to be so loving and so will allow me to like be with you and hold you and not get up and leave and i was jokingly saying that well fast forward now that i have olivia which is a golden um complete opposite of, of ellie she's um even though uh, Olivia is very independent, she's very, very loving and, and requires a, a lot of attention. And I know that's my Ellie going, uh -huh. see? <laughs> so yes, do I do I feel our loved ones bring us people and pets as companions? Yes, they do. They, they, they bring people and pets into our, our awareness, into our circle, but they can't make us like get a pet or have a relationship with somebody and I'm not talking like a romantic relation. I'm talking any kind of relationship, but they can bring, bring things into, into our, into our circle, into our awareness. It's up to us. We have free will to choose. So I hope, hopefully that answers that question you guys. I go live every Wednesday evening, 8 PM central, 9 PM Eastern um, on my Teresa Rose Facebook page, as well as YouTube. I would love to connect with you guys over there. Have a great rest of your day.